Time for another quarter hunt. All right, let's break into this box and see what we got. I don't know how long this W streak's gonna last. I hope it lasts for a while though. All right, we've got circulated quarters. You guys know the drill. I'll bring you in if we get a find. <laughs> Unbelievable. Roll number six. And we got a dirty 2019 W. It's another American Memorial Park. You'll remember we uh, found one in our last hunt. So super happy to have it. We'll see if we can't get her looking a little bit better. Look at that. W number two of the box. And it's a V75. And it's a Salt River Bay. Nice. I don't believe it. W number three of this box. It's another uh, 2020 V75. See the V75 right over there? And it's a Weir Farm. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. W number four. It's another V75. And it's an American Samoa. Absolutely unbelievable. All right, that brings us to the end of a fantastic quarter box hunt. I just cannot believe how many finds we had in this box. Um, it's been the best quarter box I think I've had in a long time. So we had four W quarters this box. We had an American Memorial Park, and she's seen better days, but still a W, so you can't be too mad at that. We found a 2020 Salt River Bay. V75, nice. And then we found a Weir Farm, V75. And then our last 2020 W was this an American Samoa. Acetone helped these quite a bit, except for the uh, American Memorial Park. But uh, overall, can't be too mad. And then I found a couple of interesting Wilma Man Killer quarters. And to me, and I don't even know if I can get it to show on here. It almost looks like running from the nose down the side of his mouth, there's a die crack. And we'll try zoom in. I don't know if you guys can make that out or at all. And there's also some die polish, uh, polish marks right above the date, below his, his uh, chin and right next to his neck. I didn't see any other signs of anything else. But I found two of them like that. You can see the die polish marks right there. But uh, obviously it's 
nothing too big. Um, but uh, let me know what you guys think. Is it a die crack? Is it uh, post mint damage? What do, what do we got going on? And I will also make sure to put uh, a picture up of each uh, obverse here. Uh, and then again here. So you can guys take a look at it. Um, so yeah, no, pretty happy with this. So we're going to get it wrapped back up and move on to the next hunt. I just want to take a moment to shout out to my existing and new subscribers. We are so close to a thousand subs and I am so appreciative. You guys just don't, you, you won't believe it. I'm so, so grateful. Uh, really, really, really grateful for it. If you happen to be watching this video and you aren't a subscriber and if I've earned it, I hope you'll consider subscribing and hitting the bell for notifications on my next video. If you like this video, I hope you'll smash that like button. As always, thanks for watching and happy hunting. Thank you.